Imam al-Mahdi is a righteous man from among the descendants of Prophet Muhammad. Peace and blessings of Allah be upon him. He will come not long before the Day of Judgment, and his appearance is one of its great signs. The Mahdi will appear after the time has turned bad, and the earth is filled with injustice and evil. He will come not long before the Day of Judgment, and his appearance is one of its great signs of the coming of the Day of Judgment. First of all, it is important to say Imam Mahdi will be from the lineage of Prophet Muhammad. Peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, as stated in the following hadith. It is reported that Umm Salama, may Allah be pleased with her, said, I heard the Messenger of Allah, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, saying the Mahdi will be from my lineage, from among the descendants of Fatima. And it is also reported in another authentic hadith that Ali, may Allah be pleased with him, said, the Messenger of Allah, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, said the Mahdi is one of us from our family. Allah will correct him in one night. Also, in a commentary on this hadith, as Suyuti, may Allah have mercy on him, said, that is, will make him fit to lead and rule the caliphate suddenly and instantly. Mullah Ali al-Khari, may Allah have mercy on him, said, that is to say, in one night or overnight, will put his affairs in order, grant him a high position, and the people endowed with the right to make decisions on behalf of the community of Muslims will unanimously recognize him as the caliph. Imam al-Albani, may Allah have mercy on him, said, The words yuslihuhu lahu mean that he will not be inwardly ready for leadership. Allah will make him fit to be the leader of the Islamic community overnight. These words do not mean that the Mahdi will be wicked and then become righteous, nor does it mean that he will be ignorant and become learned overnight. The Mahdi will appear after the time has become corrupt and the earth is filled with injustice and wickedness. He will come not long before the Day of Judgment. In turn, the appearance of Imam Mahdi is also reported as well as how long he will rule. In an authentic hadith, it is reported that Abu Sa'id al-Khudri, may Allah be pleased with him, said, The Messenger of Allah, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, said, The Mahdi is from my progeny. He has a protruding forehead and an eagle nose. He will fill the world with impartiality and justice, just as it was filled before with injustice and oppression. He will rule for a period of seven years. The version of this hadith quoted by At-Tirmizi reports that Abu Sa'id al-Khudri, may Allah be pleased with him, said, We were afraid that something unusual would happen after our Prophet peace and blessings of Allah be upon him. And we asked the Prophet about it, who said, Verily, a Mahdi will appear in my community who will stay for five or seven or nine. The transmitter of this hadith, Zayd al-Ammi, doubted exactly how much he said, we asked him, what is it? He replied, years. Further, the Prophet, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, said, and a man will come to him and say, O Mahdi, give me, give me. The Prophet, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, said, and he will give him as much as he can carry. Ibn Majah's version reports that the Prophet, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, said, the Mahdi will appear in my community and will stay among you for seven or nine years, and the members of my community will abide under him in a prosperity the like of which they have never experienced. And there will be a fruitful time in which nothing will be saved from people and property will be very plentiful at that time. When a man comes to him and says, O Mahdi, give me, he will say, take it. He, Imam Mahdi, will appear after the earth is filled with injustice and tyranny. It is narrated from the words of Abdullah ibn Mas'ud. May Allah be pleased with him, that the Prophet, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, said, If there was only one day left for the existence of this world, Allah would extend that day to send a man from my progeny or from my family, whose name is the same as my name and whose father's name is the same as my father's name. He will fill the earth with justice and impartiality as it was before him full of injustice and tyranny. Sufyan in his hadith said, this world will not cease to exist or will not be destroyed until a man from among the members of my family, that is, descendants, whose name will be the same as my name, reigns over the Arabs. From this we understand that Imam al-Mahdi's name is Muhammad ibn Abdullah al-Mahdi or Ahmad ibn Abdullah al-Mahdi. It is narrated from Abu Sa'id al-Khudri, may Allah be pleased with him, that the Messenger of Allah, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, said, 
Avos is the one behind whom Isa ibn Maryam will pray. And it is also reported from Jabir, may Allah be pleased with him, that the Messenger of Allah, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, said, When Isa, son of Maryam, comes down, and their Amir al-Mahdi says to him, Go and lead our prayer, Isa will reply, No, for some of them are the Amirs of others, as an honor from Allah to this community. The basis of this hadith is given in Muslim Sahih 156, in another way, from Jabir ibn Abdullah, may Allah be pleased with him, who said, I heard the Prophet peace and blessings of Allah be upon him say, A group from my community will not cease to fight for the truth until the day of resurrection. The Prophet peace and blessings of Allah be upon him also said, And Isa the son of Maryam, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, will descend, and their emir will say to him, Go and lead our prayer. Isa will reply, No, for some of you are the emirs of others, as an honor which Allah has bestowed on this community. When will Imam Mahdi appear? The appearance of Imam Mahdi is one of the great signs that the Day of Judgment is approaching. However, there is disagreement about the exact order in which the signs of the Day of Judgment will appear. But we can say that Imam Mahdi will appear before the appearance of Isa Jesus, the son of Maryam, peace be upon him. The following authentic hadith points to this as proof. It is reported from Jabir, May Allah be pleased with him, that the Messenger of Allah, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, said, When Isa, son of Maryam, comes down, and their Amir al-Mahdi says to him, Go and lead our prayer, Isa will reply, No, for some of them are the Amirs of others, as an honor from Allah to this community. The fact that Isa, peace be upon him, will pray for Imam Mahdi, indicates that he was Mahdi, will come before Isa, peace be upon him, as it is known that Isa, peace be upon him, will be the one who will kill Dajjal, which indicates that Dajjal will appear at the time of the Mahdi. The exact date of both the Day of Judgment and the appearance of Imam Mahdi is known only to Almighty Allah, most holy and great is He. Allah Almighty says in the Holy Quran, They ask you, Prophet, about the hour, when will it happen? Say, My Lord alone has knowledge of it. He alone will reveal when its time will come, a time that is momentous in both the heavens and earth. All too suddenly, it will come upon you. They ask you about it as if you were eager to find out and say, God alone has knowledge of when it will come, though most people do not realize it. We ask Allah for help and protection.